Hello, Native Instruments. I'm going to show you a super bug in Tractor when you try to load music from an external hard drive where you have a large library. So here we go. For Tractor, here's Tractor Pro 3.0.2, as you can see here. I don't know if you can see it. Anyway, that's what it is. Okay, so I'm using a default settings, uh, you know, default collection. As you can see, it's a default collection that comes with Native Instruments, so no added stuff. And I'm using uh, default uh, TSI settings. So let's go to Explorer. Let's go to D, E, sorry. I'm gonna try to add this folder. So I say import to collection. Look what happens. It stalls for like a minute or two and you're gonna see what happens. So let's wait and see what happens. So there's no special settings. Basically, it's all default settings because it's default TSI. The only thing I unchecked was uh, to determine automatically the the size of the files, uh, you know, and the time and all that. That's all. The rest is all default. So you, as you can see, it's stalling. And after a while, it's gonna it's gonna basically stop responding. It's gonna basically crash. And then I'll show you in Tractor uh, Two, the latest version of Tractor. It's two point three point eleven. What happens? But basically, this is, is a pretty serious bug. That's why I call it a super bug. Because it's basically unusable uh, for certain situations. So now, see, see now it's gonna be like as if it's importing. So it's gonna start importing. Fine. And then after, eventually, it's going to stall. I've done this several times, so I'm pretty confident it's going to stall. But let's see what happens. See? There we go. Close the program or look for a solution. So basically, it stopped working. Uh, I'm going to close the program. And I'm going to load up Tractor 2 to show you that it does work in Tractor 2. So it's going to close on its own. There we go. It's closed on its own. Now, Tractor 2. See? Here's Tractor 2. Let me open that up. Give it a few seconds. Okay, you can slide the root. Went to default root, whatever, it doesn't matter. Give it a few seconds. Yeah, it should be opening up very soon. Okay, it's opening up. Perfect. It's taking time, but it's opening up. Shouldn't be too much longer. Please bear with me. Okay, perfect. Updating settings files. Shouldn't be too much longer. Okay, perfect. Now you're going to see how fast it imports. It imports like instantaneously and it won't crash. I'm not going to import everything because there's a lot of songs, but it's just to show you that uh, it's a serious bug. It needs to be addressed immediately. I'm surprised nobody detected it. So import to collection. There we go. See? Hands down, it works, see? Right away. The other one, even if it allowed to import there, it was too slow, so it doesn't make sense. Also, what I wanted to mention is, uh, I don't know if the bug exists in other places, but let's say you're relocating something, so you scan something and you scan consistency, and you get uh, songs that, uh, you know, they, they're missing, so you relocate them. So while you're relocating them, it, you know, it, choose, it chooses to, to look all over the place or whatever, certain file. So let's say you can't cancel. So let's say you're playing. So you, you press cancel. It keeps on going, keeps on going. So you, Tractor becomes unresponsive. You can't do any other functions because the consistency uh, report stays there and it keeps on searching and searching. So you need to fix that. So if you press cancel, it should cancel.
Like in this case, it'll cancel. Hopefully it'll cancel. Uh, looks like the cancel import doesn't even work. So that's a bug you guys have to fix. Whether it's two or three, it doesn't matter. It has to be fixed. So that's the end of this video. Basically, I'm going to shut down Tractor. And hopefully you can fix this problem sooner. Sooner than later. Okay, thank you for... Thank you for listening. Thank you for watching.